starts now. A festival for family fun sparked outrage in Bartlett today when a group set up a booth covered with images some families found had no place at a family affair. Action News 5's Lauren Squires is live in the newsroom with what she's uncovered about Act for America and their message. Lauren. Well, Anna Marie, late tonight, calls came into our newsroom about what was happening at the festival. One Muslim woman, Muslim woman I spoke with said she was afraid to go on camera, but said she found the anti-Muslim display inappropriate and offensive, especially at an event slated for families. There wasn't much left in W.J. Friedman Park in Bartlett Saturday night, but Friday and Saturday, among dozens of other booths, this one stood out. It was sponsored by ACT Memphis, part of a national nonpartisan group concerned about the threat of radical Islam. This was their display at the fair, a picture of fiery World Trade Center towers on September 11th next to President Barack Obama. ACT Memphis organizers say they paid $50 to set up here at the Bartlett Festival and that the festival was sold out until another vendor offered them an extra spot. But the organizer would not go on camera, claiming that National Act America doesn't do interviews that can be edited, only live. As for the city of Bartlett, the application for all groups asks for a description of the booth, but offers no guidelines on who can and can't apply. Now, Bartlett Mayor Keith McDonald confirms that Act Memphis was at the festival, but had no comment about whether their content was appropriate. He said he just simply didn't have enough information to comment and asked us to call his office on Monday. Reporting live, Lauren Squires, Action News 5.